Yeah, this looks fun until you realize it's the same clip showing over and over again. Here we are. Let's play Donkey Kong Jr. Math Part 3. Here host Prince of Koopas. We will begin the set the first of two multiplication segments in this game. One digit multiplied by another digit. These are easy. In fact, I don't know how my high score is so low. Oh, that's probably why. You have to actually do you have to go backwards. You have to do the far digits first. And the time limit is really strict here. Like you would think you would do put the zero and then the three. That that's a smart way to go. That's how I would do it in real life, but no, this game defies logic. With such challenging problems, like four times two. How is this game is one of the hardest games of all time? Four times two. Yeah. Can anyone explain why I have to do the problems backwards? That means I have to know what the answer is before you actually do the problem. Or do the work. That that may that might be why they gave you so much time to walk across the lines so you can figure out what number you're gonna put on first and then second. This is very quick. One times four. Shit, I don't know. Is it four? A better be four. I'm not gonna get the answer wrong on purpose. I hope I won't. But one times four is the hardest problem we've encountered so far. Three times three. Here we go. Square number. Oh, we have to climb all the way to the top for that, but... There we go, that will be the fourth level. And it's the quickest one in the game. Hello. Now we go to... an obscenely scary and difficult problem. Six digits added by six digits. Lots of one carrying over here. Look at that! That's fucking gigantic! That's this monstrosity of a number, man. It's very easy to get your attention diverted here. There... If the last one's... Obviously not a zero. I don't know why it's in there, but... Like, look at this gigantic monstrosity. Oh, oh, shit, no! Shit! Shit! No, that's a zero! Why is it? I press down! I press down! I press down! I press fucking down! Down! Shit, I ain't got my little shit egg. I want my shit egg. Give me my shit egg. Uh. Right? <laughs> my shit egg. This. There's a space between the shits. There's supposed to be like a, a pillar held up by sheer will of the smelly piles of crap. Now there's a gap. I don't want there to be a gap. How? It, it's just... It's, it's a... It's a piece of shit that's floating in midair. Oh, that's a two! That's a fucking... Why is this set? Oh, crap! I don't... I don't know what I'm doing. 
Oh, God. What is this number? It's a one. Right? Shit. You... Crap! I went that off. Fuck. Oh, crap. The one difficult part about this game is very easy to mess up. Very easy to mess up. Uh, and once you do, you cannot go back. There is no back button. What the hell is this one? Oh, God. Yeah, what's wrong with three? Two? Yeah, it's three! Well, what's the... Oh, it's four. It's four. It's four. What? It's not four! What the... What? Hold on. It's not two, it's not three. Are you sure it's not three? I think it's three. It was three before! Why was that marked wrong when you... Asshole. Oh, that was a disaster. Shit eggs is just bad. Where they have to resort to floating in midair. Damn, if I'm gonna do a let's play, I'm, they're not. That was not a mathematical error. That was because the game does not let you go back, or maybe it does. Does the B button even do anything? We'll see. What? What did I just do? The B plan restarts the entire level. I did not know that. Like, do I lose any points for doing that? We'll see. I probably lose something. Yeah, I lost 10 points. Or maybe I didn't. I I have no idea about any of this. So the B bummer starts everything. At a cost. I think there's a cost. I don't know. Well, let's get a B plus on this level. There, there are no actual like grades you get. I'm just making that up because my high score is 80, 800. Crap! I can't do two math things at once. 875. Then that means I got a. Like an A okay, A six. A hundred sixty fuck. A hundred sixty five, which means an A six point five. Which means I got a B. Which means I'm terrible at this game. Or I don't know. This is just the same Unlike Mario Superstar Baseball, when I talk, I'm on the title screen. It goes to a randomized play. It's just the same thing over and over. And then and this guy at the other side doesn't even move. It's bad. Well, that was uh, part three. And see you next time. When we have the scariest level in the game. Six digits subtracted by six digits. I'll see you then.